for life. Yep, I've got a nice little detonator there. Just doing the rounds. We got lucky down there, Commander. Civilians, children, could have been very bad. I don't even want to think about it. But scooping those scientists right from under the elusive man's nose, that's gotta piss him off. <laughs> I'm glad that Jacob guy is gonna be all right. I hope we can trust a bunch of ex-Cerberus. Just saying. Oh yeah? You haven't been just saying that the whole damn time, Ash? Come on now. Commander. What's the matter, Vicarian? You chicken? I don't even know what that is. Though I've heard everything in the galaxy tastes like it. But if you're suggesting I'm scared, game on, Vega. Age before wisdom. Okay. Back in my CSEC days, I busted a Vicarian spy ring that was trying to assassinate a counselor. Please, I fought off a dozen angry Vicarians on Omega single-handedly. Used one of them as a landing pad off a three-story jump. <laughs> Just warming up, seeing what you had. Now, I tracked down this guy, Salem. Stopped him from raising a Geth army and unleashing the Reapers three years ago. Doesn't count. You did that with Shepard. You're right. I was with Shepard from the very beginning. Oh, shit. This just means you're old. Oh, shit. Look at this. Guys trying to show off a little dual peacocking for for Renee Shepard over here. What's up, Garrus? I'm What's glad you saw through the elusive man. At least not everyone in Cerberus has lost their mind. This fight can use it. Very true. Don't mind us. Just telling James here what it means to be a real soldier. Hey, Commander. Hey, Commander. Maybe later. Ooh, Karis and James got a little rivalry. I love it. Glad to see Ashley starting to get a little more chattier. Still think you can win this, huh? I can do this all day, Scars. Funny you mentioned those. Ever hear the name Archangel? I might have. You know you have. I'm Maybe I heard something about that, too. Hmm. Then maybe you also heard that for a couple months there, the crime rate on oh Omega... Oh my god, the peacocking is so strong. ...while Archangel did a little house cleaning. So you ran a cleaning service on Omega. Back on Fell Prime, I uncovered a pair of harvesters. Had to kill them by myself. To worm next, that's almost impressive. Oh, that's not even the best part. They left behind an egg. It hatched, and I trained it to let me fly it. <laughs> the Alliance teach you to make up crap like that, or did you figure it out all by yourself? Wow! Yeah. Oh my god, the ribbing. Maybe later. I love it. Have we found any new engineers for the Crucible Glyph? Sonax Industries scientists who attempted to reverse engineer Prothean technology stolen from planet Garva. They are technically still wanted by the Council for hiding Prothean technology. As well, Sonax <laughs> is part of instigating an illegal war on Garva. I'm sure the Council will forgive that for helping with the Crucible. Extend those scientists amnesty and an invitation. Oh, 
Oh, Liara, don't be peeping on this. Solarian females doesn't count as fighting. Oh, God. It's good to see you. It's good to see you. A pleasure to see you. You've been through a lot, Scars. You giving up? Nah, I got more. Just don't like to talk about it. Fair enough. We've all got one of those. Just one, huh? Yeah. Not every story has a happy ending. Except there was this one time I teamed up with a Turian named Garrus Vicarian. Uh-huh. He was pretty good with a gun, but he thought he was some kind of hotshot. Yeah. Yeah, I knew this wise-ass Marine named Jimmy Vega. Sounds like a pole dancer on Omega. Always got on my nerves. But... The kid was all right. Had guts when it counted. And together they cured the genophage. And stopped Cerberus from taking over the Citadel. Yeah. And finally kicked the Reapers from this galaxy and into the next. With a little help from their friends. Nah, it was just us. But mostly me. I love it. I kind of love it. I did. I don't remember that interaction. That's a fun one. All right. Yeah. Let's let's get on this reassign powers. Let's start with that. We should definitely keep Ashley's powers. Just because squad disruptor ammo is very powerful. Liara, let's let's do a reset for Liara. And maybe not Evie. Let's poke around Javik a little bit more. Our new crew member. Called Jacob. We're both part of Cerberus. That is correct. And Cerberus is filled with traitors to humanity. Yes, they oppose us in this war. Then why should we trust either of you? We have <laughs> severed our ties with the organization. But you were programmed by Cerberus. I can extrapolate where this is going. <laughs> I have superseded my original programming and have chosen to oppose Cerberus. You mean you have chosen to oppose your creators? Correct. I find this a very troubling freedom machine. <laughs> that is all. Trippy. Commander. You settling in, Javik? I believe some of the crew wishes to be my friend. That is not my purpose here. Also, I find I need to wash my hands. The residue of this ship is strong. How so? I have been exploring. There are traces of those who lived on the Normandy before. I detected a human female. Her genetic structure was unnatural, as if artificially created. Miranda. Sounds like Miranda. Yeah, yep. And a drill. There mm. was illness in him. That was Koliak. <laughs> and the Krogan we met, who lived in these quarters. He was undergoing a metamorphosis. Good old grunt, my boy. His memories were confused, not organic to his mind. There was great confusion and turmoil. I still can't wrap my head around that. Reading information like you do. For my people, it was as natural as breathing. Evolution's an amazing force. Our scientists believe Ooh, the shepherd's the only force in the galaxy that mattered. They called it the cosmic imperative. The strong flourished, the weak perished. The governments of your cycle seem concerned with ensuring the survival of all. 
Shepard's like, Was yo, I'm so down. Was this just your scientist's opinion, or did they prove something we don't know? The universe had already proven it. They only had to look around. And saw what, exactly? Extinction is the rule of law in the cosmos. The natural order of things. The weakest species are doomed. We can't afford any weak links in this war. They drain our resources. They can become a resource of their own. How? If the Reapers are busy conquering the weak, they are not watching you. So use them as a distraction. All strategies must be considered, and few are too extreme. Though I do not think your Asari approves of my beliefs. Liara? I think she just had a different idea about what Protheans were like. We are all a product of our time. Had I been born in this cycle, perhaps I would be the noble scholar she wishes me to be. Maybe. Or maybe you'd still be a soldier. I do wonder sometimes, living a life of constant war, taking life in every battle. Does it get to you? It shapes me, as stone is shaped by the one who carves it. This stone has no choice in the form it will take. You and I, Commander, war is our sculptor, and we are prisoners to its design. Maybe not much longer. We win this and we'll both be set free. Those humans you saved were fortunate. There are still places in the galaxy to hide. Our refugees perished. There was nowhere left to run. I trust you, Commander. When you say you no longer expedite Cerberus's goals, otherwise. Whoa. Perhaps later, Commander. Commander. Citadel. Might as well. You're cleared to dock, Normandy. Do you need ground transport? 
Always. To the embassies. Navigation is becoming increasingly difficult due to the number of refugee ships in the docking area. Assisted Commander Shepard in preventing Cerberus forces from killing the Council. Huh. Hell of a view, isn't it? During our war, this place became a myth to my people. A dream glimpsed only in the memory shards. The citadel was both the heart of our civilization and its demise. The Reapers hit here first, didn't they? No one I knew had ever seen the citadel. To be here now, I don't know what to think. Unless we win this war, it'll be the last time any of us see the citadel. Soak this in while you can, Jeff. Damn. Do not be so dismissive, Commander. Psh. Someday the things you have lost will be the things you would kill to have back. Such as? Order. The rule of law. From here, our empire dictated the course of the galaxy. Nowadays, a lot of races have embassies here. It's true, then. You share power with the rest? <laughs> it's not perfect, but it's kept the peace. Most of the time. You share power. Pardon me. This one has been listening. This one suspects you are a Prothean. Ehana, I remember your kind when you were still minnows in the ocean. This one is unworthy. This one has seen the face of an Enkindler. They consider your kind to be their gods. A pity we did not teach them to speak better. You're really a Prothean? I You're a Prothean? But... Prothean? If we lost the last war, what hope do we have? For many, there may be no hope. The Reapers killed trillions in my cycle. The odds of being among the living are remote. If you are lucky, they will destroy you outright. You will avoid the fate of becoming a husk. If you cannot fight, do not let them capture you. Death is a better outcome. <laughs> it's over. We'll never win this. We won't win any new recruits, but at least they know what they're in for. It is better to fight with it your is. eyes open than your heart. That's right. Is that the Prothean way of war? It is the way of life. Yes. I will meet you back on the Normandy, Commander. Tough way to go. Heavy losses are mounting as human colonies of Elysium tip to the Atlas. Look, I filled out all the forms you requested and stuffed through every hoop. I don't even know where Neota is, and I'm gonna be deployed soon, too. Ooh, we've got some uh, business to attend to, huh? Command abilities request to assist with the con man preying on refugees. The man has explored loopholes for lawyers' arrest. Yep, I like that. Meds originally meant for occupied zones have been rerouted. The supplies are currently in lockdown but can be released under Spectre authority. CSEC has filled a request for a civilian militia to defend it in the event of another attack. Beautiful. Um, this report is for top level embassy access only.
Huh. Patriot Act and Mass Effect. <laughs> Location for Din Korlak. You're all right, Shepard. Miranda, what's going on? Couldn't meet in person. The Citadel is too dangerous right now. I heard about the attempted coup. Yeah, with Kai Lang's help, Edina nearly seized control. Kai Lang? That slippery bastard's still alive? He's alive and right in the middle of all this. That complicates things. I'll be on my guard. Look, I don't have much time, but I learned what happened to my sister. Where is she? I don't know that yet, but my father was definitely responsible. If he's done anything to her, I'll kill him. Miranda. Shepard, listen. I'm being hunted by Cerberus assassins, a lot of them. I need to stay out of sight. What? Why? I assassins, Shepard. Maybe more that my father is working on something for the elusive man. Something big. Why would your father be working with the elusive man? Especially now. My father is ruthless about preserving his legacy. Legacy? He has an obsession with making his mark in history, ensuring his dynasty lasts forever. And you think the elusive man made him an offer? Exactly. I wish I could help, but too many lives are depending on me. I know. I'm not asking for your help. I need to do this myself. It's time I stopped running from him. Okay. Keep me posted. I will. I did not mean. I You're did not mean. To dock, Normandy. Do you need ground transport? I didn't mean to straight up deny Miranda there. We're just gonna do a quick little. During our war, this place. The Reapers hit here first. No one I knew had ever seen the Citadel. Unless we do not be so distant. Someday the things you such as order. Nowadays, a lot of rape. It's true, then. It's not perfect, but it's... Hold this They consider your kind... A pity. You're really a... I am. But... For many, the Reapers killed trillions in my cycle. The odds of being among the living are remote. If you are lucky, they will... Dis if you cannot... It is... Is better. that the protein? I will meet them. No replacement has been selected.
You're all right, Shepard. Miranda, what's going Couldn't on? Couldn't meet in Perth. I heard about the attempted... Yeah, with Kai Lang's help. Kai Lang? He's alive and right now... That complicates things. Look, I don't have much time. Where is she? I don't know that yet. If he's done anything to... Miranda. Shepard, I'm being hunted by Cerberus... What? I heard a rumor. Something big. Why would your father be working with the elusive man? Especially... My the... father is... Legacy? He has an obsession. And you think the elusive... Exactly. Whatever's going on with your father can't be good. We have to figure this out. I agree, but I need to do this myself. It's time I stopped running from him. You're sure? Yes. I can't think straight until I know Ari is safe. Be careful. I can't promise that, Shepard. Could you? No. Hmm. I couldn't. Oh, she'll be fine. She'll be careful. There is a party going on at Purgatory. Cerberus has changed their ciphers, and our codebreakers aren't getting anywhere. I've got our best team working in shifts on this, but ensuring Citadel systems integrity is just going to take time. If we can get some of their field encryption tools, maybe sample ciphers. I understand. Keep trying. I'm in the shower with hot water and everything. Welcome to Serta. Thank you for shopping. I don't I want to do more than that, but yes. Hey, Shepard. I'm glad to see you. I know things are crazy right now. Exactly. So you have to take the moments when you can. What's going on with the Crucible? That project is crazy. Freaking huge. And all these brilliant minds are working night and day trying to figure it out. I wish you could see them. Heads down, piecing it together. It's something to see. We'll get this Crucible built, Shepard. And then, we'll win this thing. I feel it. Do you feel it? Yeah, sure. I feel it. And I'm counting on you and everyone there. Get it done. Believe it. Uh... It was interesting to meet Bryn. How is she? She's great, actually. It's good to see her work without the distraction of having to worry about the colony. And you and her? We're... We're having a baby, Shepard. Wow. Congratulations. Wasn't exactly planned, but I'm looking forward to it. I'm gonna be a better father than mine was. Do the whole thing right. Real high bar uh... standard there. <laughs> 
One more thing to fight for. You got that right. Bryn wants to name it after you. Really? Yeah. <laughs> Shepherd. That's nice. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna talk her out of it. No offense. <laughs> None taken. Good. <laughs> so what's going on with you? You still like what you're doing? Things are good. I'm good. Still not tempted to come back to the Normandy? Always tempted. Damn, Shepard. <laughs> Thirsty. But no. So, you working on the Crucible? <laughs> Don't get me wrong. I'm smart. But not that smart. Packet keeps me busy, though. How's he doing? Holding up. If they make old guys any tougher than that, I'd like to see it. I'm glad we had time to talk. Me too. You gotta take the moments when you can. So true. So true. And Shepard, thanks again for getting my people out alive. Take care, Jacob. You too, Shepard. I'm thinking about you out there. Stay safe. Something else? I'm glad we had time. Me too. And Shepard. Take care, Jacob. You too, Shepard. Knowles, this is Shepard. I found one of the code locations. Okay, I'll shut it down. Just need to authorize your Spectre status. Someone used this to cut off power to a dozen life support machines in the hospital. Okay, that access code is officially disabled. Can you find any more? I overheard what you said. I found this at a Cerberus station. A poison tailored to Turians. Let me see. Yes, I think this is it. With these schematics, we should be able to come up with an antidote. Thank you. The general might pull through because of this. Yes, General Corellius should make a full recovery. He's already awake in that bunk. Oh. Oh my god. Welcome to Elkos Combine Arsenal Supplies. Well, looks like uh his business caught up with him. Any opened goods can only be returned for Please store visit credit. Any of our Elkos Combine affiliates. Embassies. For any and all personal needs. It's just at the embassies, though. Spectre status recognized. One moment, please. Now arriving at Presidium Embassy. I know we probably have to ask uh, Bailey about it. Hey, Shepard. I have to admit, the place feels safer with you here. Everyone's walking around in a daze, or in my case, limping. And I wonder Poor if it'll ever be the same. These are dark days for all of us. 
You got your work cut out for you. You and me both, Shepard. I think I recovered the obelisk you mentioned from the Shrike Abyssal. It's waiting in bay D-24. Really? Thank you, Earth Clan. Were your people involved in a secret construction project of some sort? I am certain this obelisk would help. Thank you again. Was the Volus ambassador here earlier? Yes, he was, Commander. I need in. Spectre business. I'll unlock the office when you're ready. Oh, there you go. Shit. If you sever contact, we can't protect you from the consequences. I don't. Dear I you no son of a bitch. This. We'll speak again. Have a good day, Ambassador Korlak. He's dead as fuck. The Turians think I'm still working for Cerberus. They've put a price on my head. I can't go to CSEC, but Cerberus has plans. An entire Turian colony rests on my life. If anyone finds this, I hid a tracking receiver in the office suite beside the human embassies. Said. That is surprising. This is Commander Shepard. Can you hear me? Yes. Yes, I can hear you. 
tell me where you are. Uh, we're still near the Presidium. C-Sec will check Selkish arms when they realize I'm missing. They won't give a damn when they realize you sold them out to Cerberus. Wait. Cerberus is planning to attack a colony that... Stay calm. Help's coming. Now arriving at Presidium Commons. Zaid used to work for Cerberus. Ask him why. Why? Why go after your old employer, Zaid? Now you know my name all of a sudden. Good question. Wrong door. We need you alive to stop Cerberus. Cerberus is after a Turian colony. Kill me, and they get it. Drop my name. Shepard's investigating. She's a recent acquaintance. How recent? Very. Shit. All right, I'm listening. Been a while, Zaid. Huh. Shepard. Glad I wasn't just making an ass of myself over a hunch. Undisciplined bastards. This is what I get for signing up at the last minute. Where's Korlak? I'm here, Commander. I... You saved my life. I almost died because the Turians thought I was still with Cerberus. You should have gone to C-Sec if your life was in danger. And be thrown into prison? No. The things they would do to me after the damage I caused. What intel did you give Cerberus on this colony? Information on a Turian planet's defense system. They'll strike soon. But if I tell you which planet they're attacking, Cerberus will know I turned traitor. Turn? 
You already betrayed your own people. We saved your life. Tell us what planet you put in danger. I can offer a bargain. All right, Zaid. The you play bad cop. I play bad cop. In tactical terms, and then we'll be great cops. Or you could give us both. You can warn the Turians there'll be an attack, Commander. That should be general enough to ward off suspicion. <laughs> All right. I tried playing nice. Maybe my friend can get you to see reason. Now wait just a moment. You mind, Zaid? It'd be a goddamn pleasure. Wow. I'll leave you to it. It'll be a while before anyone shows up for him. <laughs> it's Aethys. Cerberus will attack a colony called Aethys for its shipyards. And the bombing fleet? Take it. It's all yours, I promise. I'll speak with Citadel Security about this... incident. You have my thanks. Damn, he thanked you for it too. To spit that out. <laughs> what are you doing here? Later, C6 on their way. Won't be too pleased with the mess we left them. Catch up with me at the docks if you like. Huh. Two hundred. It's a lot of experience. Very close to level 56. Working on some mighty fine renegade points. Another one. Yeah, the guys in Zakara did too. Disarmed there safely. No casualties. Nice work. What? Found another one. Yeah, the guys in Zakara did too. Disarmed there safely. No casualties. Welcome to Casa Fabrication Weaponry. For the best in the business, come to Casa. Proceeds from all purchases. Thank you for shopping at Casa Fabrication Weaponry in the Alliance. Wow, that's a lot of dialogue all at Welcome once. Welcome to the Citadel Gift Shop. All proceeds from today's purchases go to the Turians. Welcome to Nosastra Sporting Goods. Shoot smart. Shoot. No Sastra. Good hunting. Supertine Armory. Professional grade equipment at reasonable prices. That's Supertine. All Supertine Armory products include a lifetime guarantee for performance. See our extranet site for details. 
What's up, girl? You sure you don't want to do something a little more exciting? I love this part of the Presidium. It reminds me of where I grew up. Where's that? Amali, da Contesia. My mother and I lived beside a park. I spent hours there. Doing what? <laughs> Reading, exploring, getting in trouble digging for ruins in the grass. <laughs> You're kidding. I was very young. We all do stupid things as kids. There's no denying that, but in a way, I was lucky. My mother scolded me, but she also bought me my first history book the next day. Aww. I miss her, Shepard. Damn, that's right. Matriarch Benesia. What was she like? She was confident and kind. She loved to wear yellow. I thought she was the most beautiful woman in the world. You'll be okay, Liara. Girl! <laughs> Thank you, Shepard. I feel better. I wish we could spend more time together like this. Just friends. What? Yeah. Excuse me. Friends doesn't cut it for me anymore, Liara. Well, that sounds serious. I am serious. Whatever happens. Oh, man. I'd like to spend my life with you. Yeah. Then you're extremely lucky that I feel that way, too. Yeah? I know. Romance from the one days. Lovely. Hello, Shepard. Really? Nice to see you. Ugh, I hate that. going on here? I'm in position at CSEC. Draw them away, and I'll move in and make the kill. Don't answer that. <laughs> what? Zeus Hope. Will your new heavy armor keep you safe? I've watched reports on some of the things you fight. Well, it won't stop a reaper, but an extra second of shielding can be life or death. So Vortex makes good shields and marketers? They don't skip on plating.
It seems the galaxy can't keep us apart. The Blue Sun's blood pack and Eclipse are in my pocket. Is there anything on your mind? We'll talk later. I'm sure. Shit. What's up, you two? What's up? Report. Hey, Commander. I was just about to get us another round. So, looks like you two are having fun. Yes. The Joker has been smiling and laughing at a significantly higher rate since he and I agreed upon a relationship. I mean, he is happier. You break his heart. Enjoy it while it lasts. It seems unlikely that you would terminate our agreement anytime soon. Or are you referring to untimely death? I was just wishing you well. I guess it's a serious possibility, though. Yes. I have not discussed the matter with Jeff, but our lifespans are not likely to be the same length. I asked Liara how the Asari deal with the problem. Hmm. She says to bottle up my feelings until the inevitable occurs, then cry. Seriously? <laughs> that was a humorous exaggeration. However, she did not provide emotionally supportive answers on disparate longevity. These are dangerous times. Make the most of it. Yep. I see. Thank you for your support, Shepard. This is proving to be an illuminating experience. as your personal assistance mech. Yeah, well, he's the only way to get you inside. But you know I am not one. Why deceive others? You don't really want to introduce yourself as an AI with Uber-based code. Yeah. They would lynch you. That would be an inefficient way to render me non-functional. Nice. Your turn. Counselor Irissa. Not hot. Too much makeup. Not hot. Shaira the consort. <laughs> Eg's having fun. Your turn, Counselor Irissa. Not hot. Too much makeup. Not really my thing. Shaira, the consort. Uh, hot, I guess. Can you stop this? You're creeping me out. Dalatrat Linron. Ew. Where did Jack go? Did I already, uh, get her that drink? You had it right. 
Yesterday can't change. Tomorrow we might all be dead. Today Whoa, Cortez. is what matters. I'm not wasting it. I wouldn't have thought a club would be to your taste. You don't have to get all hot and bothered to appreciate graceful dancing. Yeah. Some energy here. That's true. It's light. And purgatory serves the best drinks. Here. Here's to fresh beginnings. And a better tomorrow. Thank you. For everything. Fuck yeah. Knock him back. I'll see you back on the Normandy. Commander, thanks for coming. I wanted to pay my respects to your family. Yeah. I hope Sarah can find some peace here. I'm glad I can be here for her. She wanted me to say something about her family. I wanted Thomas to hear it. You need to be strong for Sarah now. You're right. I'm so proud of her. She's no career soldier, but there she is, coping with all this. Reminds me of Dad. Whatever was going on, he put a smile on his face for us. He sounds like a fine man. He did his best with four daughters and a strong wife. He always said, live fire exercises was good prep for facing his girly horde. <laughs> Your sister's waiting. You'll be fine. Right. Here we go. Okay. Remember the trip to the beach the summer before I left for basic training? Just a lot of good, uh, wholesome interactions with Ashley in this game. Yo, Marksman unlocked. That's actually a pretty good power. I'll need you back aboard the Normandy. Commander. Welcome to Vitarian State Arms. Vitarian State Arms. Defending the hegemony. Oh, we're at 90k? How did that happen? Your purchases are accredited to the hegemony. What the hell are you looking at? Nothing. Nothing. One minute you'd show up, sure. Figured you'd be too busy recruiting goddamn armies for this war you're in charge of. Hey, man. can always use more help. Back. The Blue Suns could I'll use a leader again. What happened on Earth. Tell you what, I'll see if some old contacts of mine are still around. Fuck Can't yeah. I promise you anything, but if enough of them are still breathing, I can lend a hand. You're the man, Zaid. Why go after Cerberus? 
Started with them trying to harm me back after we hit the collectors. Cerberus paid me enough after the Omega 4 relay. Retired is what I should have done. But it's tough to settle down knowing the Reapers are on their way. Why go after Cerberus? Started with them trying to harm me back after we hit the collectors. Cerberus paid me enough. Welcome to Batarian State Arms. But it's tough to settle Stand down. strong for your people the with Batarian State way. Arms. Thank you for your patronage. Thank you, human. We will all conclude having losses on our previous human colonies. Please take heed and soon as possible. Oh, okay. I recognize you. You're Commander Shepard. Yep. And you must be Tactus. Heard the refugees consider you their leader. Yes. Someone needs to sort out this mess. CSEC has tightened access to the Citadel, and we've got desperate people down here with no place to go. I also hear you need basic medical supplies. Dr. Chakwis spoke of a mutually beneficial trade. I tried to be clear. In my experience, the Alliance looks out for their own. Trust is a hard thing to come by these days. I know you need our military supplies, but they're worth far more than your basic meds. Her offer wasn't satisfactory. My mission is our only hope to turn back the Reapers. I need every edge I can get, and that includes your equipment. And the supplies I have to offer are just what your people need. Think this through, Tactus. Okay, okay, I see your point. I'll have my people contact you. Nah, this. not You'll as have fun. Your supplies as soon as possible. But I'll take what I can get. James? Commander, what brings you down here? I was about to ask you that. Well, after our little chat, I made up my mind. I'm gonna join the N7 program. And you're celebrating by getting a tattoo? <laughs> sort of. See, there's no official channels to go through right now. So, I guess this is my way of making it official. Technically, I'm just an N7 recruit, but, you know, I figure with you as my training officer, how could I fail, right? I'm flattered, but I wouldn't exactly say I'm training you. Not officially, but what the hell is in this goddamn war? 
I'm just saying, whether you like it or not, you're my direct superior and you're N7. So I take my lead from you. And you know, I'll take whatever advice you got. Really? Sure. It's a good advice. Don't take this lightly, Vega. I'm not. And I won't. I know it seems like I don't take things seriously. But when I commit to something, I fully commit. Oh. Clearly. Hey, I won't let you down. Hey. Don't just tell me. Show me. Yes, ma'am. You know, that's gonna sting for a few days. You gonna be ready for duty? Always. Hey, maybe we should get matching. You want me to get an N7 tattoo? N7? Sure. Or you could get my name done. Somewhere special. You're such a tease, Vega. Who, me? You ever gonna make good on all this flirting? Shep! Uh, I was just... I didn't mean to... You know, I was just... <laughs> That's what I thought. Later, Lieutenant. Later. Sick. Ah, careful! Why go after Cerberus? Started with them trying to harm it back after we hit the collector. This is the Academy House, so we all make our first releases. The Gallus forces were in. The Phantom Guards are settled down. Now it's the Wayfarer Guards. Spectre status recognized. One moment, please. Now arriving at docking bay B24. Ooh. Oh, well. Shepard. Glad you came. What'd you have in mind? Something that doesn't involve fighting reapers. I don't think they've conquered the bar yet. I already scoped it out. But then I thought, if this was my last day alive, I'd actually like to remember it. So? So, I had an idea. going somewhere we're not supposed to some things never change do they ever have that one thing you always wanted to do before you died Shepard too busy trying to live what's yours <sighs> the whole time I worked at CSAC I'd stare up at the top of the Presidium and say to myself y'all telling me that Shepard isn't meant to be renegade there. by default but I never did there were a hundred and thirty seven regulations telling me I couldn't so you got them changed? No. Now I just don't give a damn. <laughs> oh. Figured it's time to do something stupid just for the hell of it. Might be the last chance we ever get. A little busier than I imagined. How about a dive in the pool? You obviously haven't seen Turian swim. It's a lot of flailing and splashing interrupted by occasional bouts of drowning. The occasional right. bouts, huh? I just have to save your ass again. It'd make up for all the times I pulled your ass out of the fire. Novaria, Pharos, Ilos. We've had a hell of a ride, haven't we, Shepard? I think that ride's been rough on you, Garrus. You got a new scar every time I see you. Losing a step there in your old age? <laughs> Raise your hand if you haven't been killed before. <laughs> now, before we head back, there is one thing we're going to settle. Once and for all. Oh, yeah? Not saying you don't know how to handle a gun. Just saying some of us know how to make it dance. So, let's find out who's really the best shot. Well, there are a few people in the galaxy who have seen me in action, Garrus. I don't know if you notice, Garrus. Yeah, but I've actually. But seen I don't really use a sniper shit. rifle. No comment. I don't even use a All pistol. Right, Victorian, you're going down. And don't worry, I loaded it with practice lugs for when you miss. That was an easy one. Let you build up your confidence. Long range, I wrote the book. Nobody alive can do this, not even Commander Shepard. Give me a tough one. I 
said a tough one. Give him a little step aside. Oh shit. Do it. Do it. I'm Garrus Vicarian, and this is now my favorite spot on the Citadel. Oh, that joke it's doesn't up here. that joke doesn't land I think for I'm me. I'm going to erect a monument right here. Bronze this gun so the whole galaxy knows that you're the king of the bottle shooters. Glad you're around, Garrus. Never know when the bottles might revolt. <laughs> <laughs> That's fun. That was quite lovely, Garrus. Good man. Good shit. Oh, there's a console in here. I'd like to request a transfer to a zone with Reaper Sergeant. And may I ask why you think your deployment deserves special treatment, Private? I think I'll be better against the Reaper Sergeant. Knowles, I found another spot with a Batarian code. Holy crap. These are the remote navigation codes. Last week's crash at the docks, we thought it was an accident. Outstanding. So we've got Batarian codes and someone with a grudge against Please humans. Select the destination. Looks like okay. This code's offline now as well. Should just be one left, Commander. Area one moment. Knowles, this is where the last access code was used. What's that, Commander? I'm losing your signal. Yeah, I bet you are. Shepard. Bow. Oh. You should have killed me on that asteroid over Terra Nova. Well, well, I'm well. I'm waiting for this. Everything that has happened to my people is your fault. All I did was stop you at Terra Nova. Yes, after you ruined my plan. My government accelerated research efforts on the Leviathan of Dis. Have you huh. heard of it, Commander? The ancient organic dragon I have actually. people recovered from Jartar 20 years ago. Sound familiar? A Reaper. Your people were studying a Reaper corpse. Yes. Looking for a way to reclaim our place as the true power in the galaxy. Hundreds of our best scientists were enlisted. And then they became indoctrinated. When the Reapers reached Karshan, our own people betrayed us. Defense grids were deactivated. Ships fired on allied targets. We were destroyed from within because of you. The Batarians made enemies throughout the galaxy. And now you've paid the price for it. Yeah. We were a proud race. A beautiful race. A slave on the Reapers race. have done to us. I'm trapped on this citadel. Our warships only know the locations of Reaper forces because I've tapped council transmissions. Oh, and then I'm you the pull highest that, ranking huh? military officer left in the hegemony. And I can't save my people. But I can end you. You need me. You're not gonna pull that trigger. 
You know what I'm doing out here. Yes. Forging alliances with the Turians, the Krogan. Killing you will tear all the other races apart. And then the Reapers wipe out the last of your warships, the last of your people. And you know that. That's why you'll join us. We're all you have left. I could kill you. I could do it right now. Uh huh. <laughs> Our ships are yours. Wow. Shepard, are you all right? We just Fine. talked him down. Let's go. You won't have any more trouble with those codes. Is that? Do you want me to arrest him? I want you to put a bullet in his head. We're all making some sacrifices today. Nice. Let him go. Spectre authority. Understood, Commander. And thanks. Don't worry about it. Spectre authority. Hey, we actually got some of the hegemony in, the, in here somehow. Pretty shocking. Didn't we do this mission? Sergeant, I have a little brother. He went off planet to try and make money. He's come with a lousy salary. A week before the rebel, my brother sent me a private message. Let's speak. Always fall through, Commander. Yeah. We've received the supplies from Tactus. Nice. Everything good? Indeed. We've acquired some very useful equipment. As such, I've been able to enhance the effectiveness of our Medijal delivery systems. Lovely. I've also collated information that Liara may find of interest. Check with Glyn. Nice. And we level up. Uh, could be useful. Have a do a little crowd control on uh, shields and barriers. That'd be great for phantoms, actually. Boost weapon accuracy and fire rate. Hmm.
Maybe later. Hey, Commander. 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 I think speaking with the Quarians might be ideal. Commander Shepard, a pleasure to see you again. Huh. Though I wish it were under better circumstances. Admiral Ron, yeah. I'd hope for your support in the fight against the Reapers. What's going on? Seventeen days ago, with precision strikes on four Geth systems, the Quarians initiated the war to retake our homeworld. Which was a clear violation of our agreement with the Council to avoid provoking the Geth. A treaty violation is nothing compared to recovering our homeworld and advanced AI technology. Your homeworld? You mean Renok? Correct, Commander. 300 years ago, we lost our world to our own AI creations, the Geth. After we attempted to kill them? We didn't try to kill them, Chorus. We tried to deactivate them. It wasn't murder. That's a tough one. What does Renee believe when it comes to this stuff? You were definitely disproven with Legion. But Shepard. Would have been easier all around if you'd succeeded. Renee Indeed. should have, yeah. Our predecessors Renee underestimated would the have threat. Been that they gave the for Geth sure. time to mobilize. Whereas you chose to attack the Geth rather than consider negotiation. I'm glad to hear that you're finally reclaiming your home world. Actually, our timing may have been premature. We'd driven the Geth back to the home system when this signal began broadcasting to all Geth ships. The Reapers. Under Reaper control, the Geth are significantly more effective. Our fleet is pinned in the home system. If we're going to win, we have... Wait! You insisted on involving the civilian ships, Admiral Geralt. Oh. We need to retreat or we'll lose the live ships. Oh. Where's the signal coming from? You guys just need some reinforcements. Get Dreadnought. It can outgun anything we've got, and it's heavily defended. Okay. The Normandy stealth drive can get us in undetected. I could board, then disable the Reaper command signal. Yes. Cutting off the signal should throw the Geth into complete disarray. And when the Geth are weakened, you strike hard. A hell of a risk, Commander. But if you can pull it off... Just be ready, Admiral. Our newest admiral has also volunteered to offer technical expertise. Oh yeah? Talizora Vas Normandy, reporting for duty. 
Admiral. Glad you could make it, Tally. Tally. Admirals. Zora. Already a team to hit that dreadnought. Thank you, Commander. Welcome back, Tally. Admiral. It's mostly a formality. I'm an expert on the Geth. That you are. <laughs> I'm glad you're here. If I'd known it was this bad, I would have come sooner. You've had your own troubles. I'm sorry about Earth. We've got the largest fleet in the galaxy. If you can help us, we'll hit the Reapers with everything we've got. Or however much is left from this stupid war. I thought you'd support the invasion. No. After talking to Legion, I thought maybe there was a chance for peace. Oh, damn. So why help them? I'm an admiral. People look to me for guidance. Public disagreement would divide the fleet. I'll help your people win this war, Tally. Thanks, Shepard. And just so you know, I need to keep things strictly business in front of the admirals. If you'd like to catch up, let's talk somewhere private. Sure nice. thing. Yeah. Yeah, girl. I'm ready to hit that dreadnought whenever you are. Nice. Commander. Commander. Shepard, the fleet is under heavy fire. We need to hit the dreadnought. I'd like to know about your patrol fleet. In peacetime, the patrol fleet managed navigation, internal security, and intership conflicts or crimes. Now, we mostly guard the heavy fleet's flank. It's mostly light frigates or fighters. What can you tell me about Admiral Garrel's heavy fleet? It was our main military force before the war, comprised of all Korean vessels suited for sustained combat. It can't compare to the Turian forces, of course, but we have a number of heavy frigates and advanced fighter forces. Tally said you had the largest fleet in the galaxy. The Turians have more dreadnoughts. Their overall military force is larger than our heavy fleet by far. But before we began this war, we jury rigged every Quarian ship in the flotilla for battle. Even our live ships have cannons. Use what you got. Yeah, that's, that's Indeed, not a bad idea. With the modifications, our live ship cannons are comparable to the main guns on a dreadnought. Impressive. They lack the armor of a real dreadnought. 
but they can back the heavy fleet formidably when needed. Tell me about the civilian fleet. Uh, our civilian ships, medical vessels, and live ships. Admiral Corris coordinates them, though individual ships' captains still have power. In peacetime, they made up the bulk of our fleet. Now, our strength would even give the Turians pause. Which fleet does Admiral Zen command? Special projects. It's not a fleet per se, just a few research vessels. Her technical breakthroughs have put us within striking distance of the home world. I'll let you get back to work. Thank you, Commander. It's a neat little handshake there, just... Oh. Here I am. Volus Bombing Fleet. That's fucking awesome. <laughs> Turing assets. What's up, girl? That dreadnought is tearing through our fleet. Let me know when you're ready to hit it. So, how did you end up back with your fleet, Tally? When the war started, the Admiralty Board asked for my help. I had more recent contact with the Geth than most of my people. They hadn't filled the spot on the board left by my father. I was invited in. It's just a technicality. I'm far too young to be a real Admiral. Don't sell yourself short, Tally. The board needed yeah. your expertise. You needed the authority that comes with rank. How is it being back with the fleet? Right now, it's exhausting. I'm an admiral in the middle of a war. I just want us to get out of this alive. Everything else can wait. When this is over, I could use your help. I can't, Shepard. If we survive this, we'll have a home world. My people need me. I need you. You could help your people's and I'm home your people. world by fighting the Reapers. I don't know. Like I said, I'm not thinking that far ahead yet. How did the war with the Geth get started anyway? Admiral Zen developed a scanning countermeasure that interferes with Geth active scans. It's like a flashbang grenade. It effectively crippled the Geth ships in combat. My fleet couldn't pass up the chance to attack. Could we use it to fight the Reapers? It only works against the Geth, unfortunately. Their AI lets them use extremely detailed LADAR pings. Zen's countermeasure overwhelms them with garbage data. Trash. And it's useless now that the Reapers have upgraded their processing power. So what about Legion? It returned to Geth space after you turned yourself into the Alliance. And you haven't seen it since? I... Uh, Legion and I sent a few messages. I was hoping we could try negotiation. But I was outvoted three to two. Admiral Chorus was the only one who believed it would work. Any idea where Legion is now? No. In our last message, it told me that the Geth were having trouble reaching consensus. And then nothing? Maybe it was fighting the Reaper takeover? Or maybe it didn't want to give intel to an enemy? I could have warned it about the invasion. I didn't. You'd have been betraying your own people. Yep. Shepard's like, I know all about that. I never wanted to be an admiral. 
that's good. Talk to you later, Tally. If you want to catch up in private, call me up to your cabin. Commander. Commander. Nervous, you can't even imagine them naked because, like, who knows? Is a tentacle monster under there? What's that? What's under there? How's Jacob? He'll be okay. Oh, glad to hear it. Nice to see those Cerberus scientists come to their senses. After everything he's done, the elusive man can't pretend he's fighting for humanity. Anyone who isn't indoctrinated has to see that by now. Glad we got out early. What's on your mind, Edie? The Yara recently requested assistance in calculating whether the mass effect is a phenomenon that occurs only in our universe, or in all possible universes. Hmm. It may be that our laws of physics only occur in a finite area, a bubble, if you will, in an ocean of other possibilities. I'm speculating whether, if you went far enough out, or created enough energy, you could reach a place where one plus one equals three. Everything would change. All energy, all matter, all the underlying mass of the universe would be unrecognizable to us. Why? What were you thinking? I'll get back to you on that. Hello, Shepard. Commander.